Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamu alaikum my name is Asan and today we are going to change flag in polylang language switcher plugin in wordpress before starting work it's my request please subscribe my channel thank you now back to our work so we are using polylang plugin and we will add custom flag now on screen you see flag so we are going to change this flag to our custom flag now go to dashboard so we are in wordpress dashboard and then we are in languages setting and then you see this is our language so we are going to replace this flag to our custom flag in language setting you see local name so you can add your file name or image name with this name so local name and your image name will be same now you see z dash underscore tw so our file name will be z dash underscore tw dot png or jpg format now go to cpanel so we are in file manager and we are in website folder and then you see wp content folder so open it and then you see theme folder so again open it so this is our current theme so open your theme folder so we are using extra theme open it now we are going to create folder now on top you see folder and then write folder name polylang and then click on create new folder so click on it now you see folder is created now open it and now we are going to upload our image file flag image file now on top you see upload so click on it now we are going to upload image file now you see button select file so click on it now you see this is our image now upload now you see image upload complete and then you see our image name z dash underscore tw dot png now go to wordpress language setting and then you see local name z dash underscore wt so our local name and image name is same now back to file manager and file upload done and then click on this link now you see this is our flag image file and now right click and then click on view so click on it so this is our file format and this is our file name and then you see 16 px width into 11 px height so this is our image file size now back to wordpress dashboard and scroll down then you see setting so click on it now setting open and then you see url modification so click on setting and then click on save changes now you see setting saved now go to website and then you see this is our flag and now refresh the page and this flag replaced with our new flag now you see flag is changed so i hope you like this video please like comment share subscribe thank you for watching